Recently in the gaming industry, Nintendo's really been trying to wrap up their game with this wonderful console, what we call the Switch. One of the aspects of fine marketing was Nintendo's great teasing of the wonderful new app that they call Splatnet 2 for the Splatoon 2 community. However, they also talked about an app alongside their online service, which Splatnet 2 is known to be in part with. So we didn't expect it when they actually collided the works of online playing to the community of Splatoon 2. But I don't know. Overnight, it started to happen. Hello everyone, welcome to Ghost Post, and today I'm going to be discussing and showcasing Nintendo's new online app that goes with the functionality of Splatnet 2. Alright, to get on the flip side of things, last night I was just bored searching Google News because it knows that I look at Nintendo stuff and knows that I like Nintendo stuff, so I'll see what Nintendo ends up. But when I looked at it, I was just already shocked when I saw what I actually was looking for. Now when I looked at an article that said that this app was out, I was flipping out of my mind. I just went down to the app store and I searched it up. Alright, so here we go. We search the Nintendo Switch and look at this. See, we don't got it up here. So we look at Nintendo controls, go down, first we go and go all the way down to the Nintendo line of apps. Go down here, boom. You can count this online, here we go. This is it. This is the app. We got 4.4 million, da like thousand or something on this thing. And oh, 1,757. That's pretty cool. Now, all in all, I didn't know what to expect out of this, but I couldn't download the app first without reading the reviews. Now, people are being salty saying that Spider-Man 2 isn't working. The reason is, it's not out yet, idiot. Now with the reason side, despite the reviews, I didn't want to look at the reviews anymore to just make me change my opinion on the app. So I just had to look at it for myself to see what it was really like. And here we are, Nintendo Switch Online. Woohoo! <laughs> Alright, so here we are. And here's the online game for the from on Nintendo Switch. You can hook it up. Uh, link it, you use your phone. Uh, I invite you to hit play. The voice chat looks awesome, man. See this? This is pretty freaking cool. Okay. And this is my first time checking this out. Alright, I'm gonna pause it real quick so I can sign in. I don't want anyone to look at my stuff. Alright, I didn't want anyone to see my personal information, so here we go. Hmm. Okay, so I don't know if I do this so I do it on my Alright, so here it is. Invitation list, game specific services, flat tune two. That was a flat net. Yep. Let's look at this. There's nothing here. <laughs> there's nothing here. Fans are being salty. Okay. So there's nothing here for now. Because the game isn't out yet, but what's the invitation list? Let me check this out. You haven't sent or received any invitation for a room be online now. That's pretty cool. Online now sounds interesting. If you receive an invitation notification or open this app from the shared invitation page, the room will be right here. Alright. Settings real quick, let me see if I can. Oh, cool. Alright, this looks pretty interesting. Let's take a picture. There's ghost post, new notification settings, detailing support website, feedback. Uh, with all this, uh, yeah, that's really not the case. Uh, okay, that's good. I mean, there's nothing else to do here now. The place is all blank, as you can see, but I mean, the place is all blank, but. Hey, it looks pretty cool. I mean, really good for something right now. But I don't, it's not like, as you can see here, uh, Splatnet 2. You can't really see that. It's just, it says game specific services. So, I mean, honestly, you gotta accept that. It's probably not like with other stuff yet. So, this isn't just for Splatnet 2. This isn't just for Splatnet 2. Like, this looks like it's for other stuff. I mean, if it's called Nintendo Switch Online, you know it's not just for Splatnet 2, right? Because if it's not just Splatnet 2, there isn't called Splatnet 2, so it's just Splatnet 2. But there's called Nintendo Switch Online, it is for all the other games. That'd be really, really cool to see. Even if they had the team for Splatoon, I don't really mind if it's just for Splatoon anyway. Like, if it's app just for Splatoon Online, it doesn't really matter what I mean. It's still pretty cool. Splatoon is a really great really game. I think you get it. I, think, I hope that all of you think you get it. Cause it's pretty freaking great, man. It's pretty freaking great. And I'm really hoping that if this app has other games coming up for it, like, I don't know. Uh, Smash Bros. hoping for that. 
and the other cool games that I've got out on the stuff. So you can bring those communities over here. That's actually going to make one hell of a good, good ass app. Like, seriously. I mean, why won't they pass up on the app? Because it's great. Tim, don't really think about all this. Alright. Closing comments about the app. Here we go. Now, this app has potential. If you guys just wanted to see what it looks like on my video before telling the whole thing, that's good. That's actually pretty good. Because you know that you shouldn't get before Splatoon 2 comes out. I'm still going to keep it because, hey, Splatoon 2 is going to come out in just a few days. It doesn't really matter. I'm still going to use it. I'm still going to hold on to it until then, until the right moment, until it's time to do everything. Because, honestly, it has some time to work. It has some time to work. And you don't have to blame it because that's just the way things go. That's the way things flow. And if you guys really think that it was really good to see what I saw in the app and my whole review of the app whenever I was looking at it good for you because I'm, I'm glad people are just still even <laughs> people are still even like just recognizing my channel that's what I like about that but aside from all that I still know that the app does have potential it is gonna go its way whenever the game comes out and I really hope that other games take place in the app too because if it's not just Splatoon 2 I really hope that other games can use online chat I mean it's another way of just making things work. It seems really, really cool. Because I don't know about the, just the friend chat in Splatoon 2. Because if you heard about the actual headsets, the physical ones that you can use, they say that they're going to be from friend games and only with friends. But it'd be really cool if we could actually just work that out with actual strangers and people you play on your teams. That'd be really, really cool. I mean, it'd be really awesome to just see what it has in store. If you can just chat with random strangers, it doesn't really matter. Cause Everyone's cool in Splatoon. Every Splatoon 2 player is cool, despite what you see at the Miiverse post, but other than just the game, it's going to be great if you just see all this other cool stuff, the functionality and stuff that the app can do. It's going to be amazing. I'm really wanting to hope that I can see some awesome stuff on this app and whatever other functions and things it can do, every other like gimmick and stuff it can do. It just seems really, really cool. I just really want to see what's happened to Titan Story and I really hope everyone else does too. So thanks for taking your time all you news and Switch players for seeing my video and actually paying attention to what I was saying, actually paying attention to a YouTuber who doesn't have too much right now. I mean, I don't even have like a lot. Like right now I'm just a 10 subscriber YouTuber and I'm not saying if you guys can help me out, but if you really like this video and really like my content, just leave a like, subscribe if you want to see more, and overall, just, I don't know, if you guys like me, put the little bell and the notifications, you know what's up, and if you guys really want to see other content for me to cover, like, anything new, like, because a lot of times I don't really know what to cover, sometimes some things don't look too big to cover, a lot of things, I just don't know, so, if you guys want me to cover anything on Nintendo, or anything on the Switch, anything at all on Nintendo, then just talk to me and holla, and I'll just be there. I'll say if it looks good, if it's good, if it's awesome. If it's like, I'll probably reply to you saying, you know, I'll probably roll with it, or I don't know if this is a big step. Like, you know, something great for everyone to see, because it's going to be pretty freaking crazy if I just cover something that nobody else will be covering and maybe other people like it because I'm the only one doing it. I mean, who knows? So, thank you all so much for watching. I'll see you guys later, probably in the comments if you comment and stay fresh. <laughs> nah, I don't know how to do that, babe. Ah.